Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com, and welcome to the update for Sunday, March 17, 2019. Happy St. Patty's Day. we got a free pick coming up in just a moment, but first a quick note, if you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com, it's a real cool way to give it a try. You click on the link below the video and you get set up for a free $60 account. You can use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages over at DocSports.com. Again, click on the link below the video to get started, get set up for that free $60 account. Uh, we had our second premium picks basketball sweep in three days on Saturday, and that included and was highlighted by a seven-unit NBA play on the Washington Wizards. A college basketball NBA sweep. The Wizards, by the way, with that seven-unit winner. We are now 6-0, 100% with our top high-end NBA releases uh, in 2019, these weekend plays. A perfect 6-0, 100% after last night's win with the Washington Wizards. We look to make it 7-0 with weekend high-end plays in the NBA this calendar year on Sunday. Big six-unit play. It's an underdog on Sunday. Uh, we like this undervalued underdog enough to make it a six-unit play. So go grab it. If we cash again, we'll be a perfect 7-0, 100% in 2019 with our weekend high-end plays in the NBA. Got one college basketball play on Sunday. Uh, it's an early game on Sunday. Go be sure to grab that on Sunday morning at DocSports.com. Going to pass in the NHL, but I've got AAF, the Alliance of American Football. You've known about that. We've talked about it. Three plays the last three weeks. We've got a perfect 3-0 so far in the inaugural season. I've got a six-unit play, biggest one so far this season in the AAF, goes on Sunday. Again, we look to stay perfect this year in that uh, particular league and go to 4-0 after Sunday's game. And by the way, I uh, wanted to mention again, the NASCAR picks are available right now. We have our two win picks posted. We've done this once so far. We brought our NASCAR picks to DocSports.com. Our first two win picks were last weekend, and we cashed when Kyle Busch took home the checkered flag. We've been doing this now for 22 years, NASCAR betting. Whether you like watching it or not, does it matter? If you like to make money, that's what we've been able to do for 22 years now. So anyway, those picks are available in NASCAR right now, our two win picks for the race in Fontana on Sunday. Go grab that. So big card, as I just mentioned. Let me recap real quickly. Six-unit play in the NBA. We look to go to 7-0 with our weekend high-end NBA plays in 2019. We look to make it a pro basketball, college basketball sweep for the third time in four days with an early college basketball play on Sunday. We've got the AAF six-unit play. We look to go to 4-0 so far this season in the AAF. And of course, NASCAR, we look to make it two for two with our winning picks available right now at DocSports.com. Basketball will be available Sunday morning, again, over at DocSports.com. All right, we got to get back in the win column with the free picks, these opinions, and we're going to go with Team 650. Tennessee minus the points over Auburn. The ball's laying four and a half. As we speak, game time, 1 p.m. Eastern. And listen, Tennessee's going to look to exact a little revenge and win the SEC tournament. They lost to Auburn not too long ago, 84-80. to You'll remember they were coming off wins over both Kentucky and, uh, and Mississippi State and then got uh, ambushed, so to speak, by the Auburn Tigers. Only lost the game by four points. Uh, but Auburn had a six-point advantage at the free throw line. Uh, they also had a nice plus five or a plus six a turnover margin. They only had five turnovers in that game. Tennessee had 11. 11 is not a lot, but when your opponent's only uh, coughing it up five times, uh, you got a minus six turnover deficit. It does tend to hurt in close games. And we think that the Tennessee Volunteers are going to be ready to get their revenge of this one, just like they were uh, after losing that first game of the regular season to Kentucky. They came back and whipped them in the second game, beat them again uh, in this tournament. But as far as what's going to happen here, you got Auburn. You know they're going to bomb away. I mean, if you look at their last five games, the Auburn Tigers, 56% of all their shots are taken from behind the three-point line. They've averaged about 31 three-point attempts in their last five games. The Volunteers are decent on the defensive deep perimeter, and I think they'll be pretty good against Auburn in this particular matchup. They're also the better rebounding team. They own a tremendous assist-turnovers ratio over their last five games. It's like 1.74, 1.75 which is obviously A-plus, outstanding. So, listen, I think Tennessee is going to be too much for the Tigers here. We're going to back the balls, minus the points, our opinion, uh, for Sunday's card. And, again, don't forget about the big six-unit play in the NBA. We'll go to 7-0 and if that one wins. We'll be 7-0 and in 2019 with our weekend high-end plays. Six-unit play in the Alliance of American Football. We look to go to 4-0 and with AAF plays since the uh, start of this inaugural football league. We look to cash again in college basketball with one play. And NASCAR, again, looked to go two for two, two for two after winning last week in Phoenix. So get it all 
uh, on Sunday morning over at DocSports.com, and let's put them in the win column. All right, that's going to do it for today. Again, the free opinion, the Tennessee Volunteers minus the points. If you enjoy these videos, be sure to click on that thumbs up button and be sure to subscribe. And we'll be right back here Monday, 4 a.m. Eastern, 1 a.m. Pacific. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com.